vibe is massive, it's supernatural. Keep it factual, you know you're matching bad. Look at the way they hold they chat. Honestly, amazing. I want you on occasion. I <laughs> Happy Sunday. Peace. It is New Year's Eve. Um, I'm home. Little man's asleep. My parents are at church. <clears throat> uh, it is exactly seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> yes, I had to count. <laughs> it's exactly three minutes till the new year. Um, I'm just sitting here just thinking and contemplating and thinking over <laughs> the the year that I had 2023 and thinking about 2024 and what like things I want for myself and really Putting in the work. Like, I'm tearing up. This ain't no way to start the year. <laughs> really putting in the work um, of pursuing my passions. Uh, look at me. No. No, 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 no. Oh, my goodness. Um. Yeah. I have to show up for myself the way I show up for other people. I have to I have to start showing up for myself. And if that means I get bags in the eyes, that means I need to buy more patches to um to take to handle that because I need to really do the damn thing. Uh, no more excuses, no more anything. I have to put in the work to try to accomplish what I want to accomplish. And if I put in the work, then I can no longer have the excuse that, oh, you know, like you put in the work. So let's see what putting in the work gets us. <laughs> but <clears throat> no more excuses for myself. And how much time? Ooh, we got one minute! We got one minute! <laughs> no more excuses for myself. Um, I gotta do what I gotta do. I have to do what I gotta do. And I can't be afraid. And I can't be scared. Or anything like that. I have to put in the necessary work. Yeah. We're almost there. <laughs> We're almost there. That's what... We're almost there. Ooh, ooh! Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Happy New Year! <laughs> Happy New Year! 2024 is going to bring good things. It is going to be not just good things. It's going to bring great things. Great, unexpected mind-blowing things that's what 2024 is going to bring us us <sighs> a fresh year a fresh year uh reset a chance to do something different it's gonna be a great year It's going to be a great year. <laughs> Ooh. Y'all. <laughs> they are going crazy with the fireworks. I feel like they've finally died down but it's been boom 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 booming over here like crazy I feel like they died down finally but it was straight a half an hour of 
boom, 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 boom. Had me feeling like I was living in Brooklyn again. Sheesh. Definitely not what I would expect from a caucastic neighborhood. But go off. I guess they have their, you know, their moments. Go off, Seth. <laughs> I put on my TikTok. I was like, I guess 2024 is off to an explosive start. It seems so because peoples. No, oh, they're still going. I don't know if y'all can hear it. It's not as much as it was, though. Let me go do something with my time, yes? <laughs> Let me go do something with my time. Ooh. Mm-mm-mm. Good morning, loves. So we're finally like up and at it. We had family devotions and I just finished up my devotions. And I freaking realized I completely forgot to share with y'all that to start off the year, I decided to do a seven day water fast. Um, basically for different aspects of myself. Mentally, I feel like I will get mental clarity. Um, Can you open your door, mommy? Spiritual clarity. And physical clarity. So, doing that and finding a way to pour into myself. Because in this household, I have no privacy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry for what I have put you through. I still have you on my mind, my mind. My focus been drifting away from you. Just wasn't our time, our time. I tried talking to y'all earlier, but my son, he was not having it, not having it at all, but it is, what's today? It's New Year's Day. I'm like, what's today? It's New Year's Day, Monday. Um, I am about to head in my bed in a minute. But I just want to come and talk to y'all. Um, so I didn't get to tell. I don't know if I told y'all. Did I? I don't, I don't know. But I'm going to tell y'all again. So. um, I had in my head to. Start. 
I'll start the year off with a fast, a water fast. Um, initially, my plan was seven days. But I've kind of changed it three days. But I have to see how I feel by the third day to maybe switch back to the seven, <laughs> to switch back to the seven days. Um, but I really just want to do it because I want to like reset my my body reset my mind you know get some mental clarity i did talk to y'all about this so i ain't gonna go into detail i think i talked to y'all about it last night this morning last night this morning you know what i'm trying to say but um so day one is down uh like i had like moments where i was hungry but like i just drink some water and then i'll be fine so, um, like I already do intermittent fasting already. So, it, it, it's like, it's not that bad for me. But I'm saying that now. Let's see what happens tomorrow. But, um, yeah, not feeling, not feeling bad right now. Uh, so I'm going to drink a little bit of water, more water before I hit my bed. Excuse me, but I've been doing like research on uh water fast, and I saw a video on the three day one by this doctor, and he was saying three day one is really really good. Um, there's this video um I want to watch about like the effects of a seven day fast, but uh the benefits of the three day uh water fast is really impressive. Um, so for me, it's like deciding whether I'll stick with the three or go back to the seven days. Um, so there's that. And then I also look kind of, well, I guess, you know, my phone was phony because like all these stuff popped up on my YouTube. Uh, so the doctor was like, also it was, which I'm happy about because it showed me how to come off of the fast. So, like, um, it talks about, you know, like, starting off with, like, bone broth or vegetable broth. And slowly from that then to, um, it said from that, from vegetable broth to fermented foods. I don't eat nothing fermented, so it's, like, sauerkraut and that kind of stuff. Yeah, you can skip me with that. Um, but then from fermented uh, foods to... Uh, cooked vegetables to from cooked vegetables uh, what was after that I think from cooked vegetables it was talking about animal proteins so yeah and I, I'm thinking that you know depending on how I feel after this to maybe do it like every three months so like yeah every three to four months I, i'd say like you know just to give my body like a little little that it needs um but i'm excited to see the results after the three days i i uh, think i'm gonna work out tonight um just maybe like a am i or do i want to go to sleep I have to make up my mind about that. I should work out. I should. Um, but the doctor again was like, you know, the first day on the fast, you can do like a normal workout, but like the second and third day to like really keep it light. So, uh, we'll see what happens. We shall see what happens. But I just think it's a nice way to just start off the year, you know, just getting clarity all around Whew, um but back to reality tomorrow back to reality tomorrow back to school back to work um work wise i don't have anything like set on my schedule yet but uh i'll try and get some stuff on tomorrow uh for the rest of the week next week i'm booked up three days straight and oh, I forgot to tell y'all. So the thing that I thought I had worked out, 
for my birthday. Remember last week I was like, oh, I think I figured out where I'm going for my birthday. Yeah. That's a no. So I'm thinking maybe I just stay home. Maybe I just stay home. Maybe. Maybe. Because almost every option <laughs> I've tried. Well, of course, there is one option that I could do where it would be completely like of no cost to me to get there and stay there, which would be home to St. Kitts. Um, so it would just be like once I get there, you know, like going out to eat because I'd be going out to eat like every day. <laughs> hey, um, it's like, why do that now? Like, I'm like maybe later on in the year I could do that, you know? So I think I'm going to stay home and I'll do food content. Like, just go different experiences, food and experiences here in New Jersey. I'm near to New Jersey. I'm near to Connecticut. I'm near to Pennsylvania. New York right there. Um, so, I could, I could do that. I could do that. I could do that. So that is an option. Uh, I think I'm going to go to... Mm, I really do want to work out. Let me do like... I'm going to do like a 15 minute something. I am. I'm going to do a 15 minute something. Because you're, you're working. You... I can't be the same person this year. I've set no resolutions at all. I've set out no resolutions. Um, yeah, nothing. I just want myself and the people around me to be happy and healthy and thriving. Like, that's all I want. Like, absolutely everyone. And for those who allow me to or those who I have the ability to do so to help to facilitate whatever I'm going to do so whatever's in my power and I pray the prayer I pray the prayer Lord remove absolutely anyone out of my life who should not be here anyone that is not of him I person gotta go so yeah that's 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 what it's gonna be Jesus who whoever it may be family friend or fool by whatever means necessary. Now I don't want nobody to die now. That's I'm not saying that. But go with God, safe journey. But here, mm mm. Alright y'all. Let me go do something. Either hop in my bed or work out. But something. My baby, I like you. My baby, I die for you. See you. You know, you know, I see you. I pray to the Lord, I rise to the Lord, gonna greet 
the Lord. I pray to the Lord for the mother Jambele. Everything being safe again, ma. Everything for your Jambele. Oh, Jambele. Oh, yeah. You are not a friend of me. No. Baby, you mean more to me. More to me. You are not a friend of me. No. Baby, you mean more to me. <sighs> Workout is done. Whew. Who knew a 15 minute worker could take the wind out of you? Well, I'm out of shape, so. <laughs> I'm about to hit the shower. Mm. Oh, goodness. Face clean, teeth brush, pum pum wash, body lotion, and I'm ready to go for it. <laughs> I'm ready to go to bed. Uh, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Night night. Good morning. First water for the day. Water and lemon. Oh. Hot water and lemon. I'm gonna let that settle in my stomach for a little bit. Then I'll have like a full bottle of water. But I'm gonna hop on my work computer and send out some emails. Let me lower y'all a little bit. There we go. Send out some work emails. Cause Things is back to normal. Reality is reality, reality, real, realitying. Wow, that took a lot. <laughs> uh, back to reality. Ooh, this water. I got my stomach feeling a little bubbly. I need to do some work. Ooh, my work computer. I've been on a pile of stuff for a few days. I forgot to unplug. So I realized that I didn't weigh myself before starting this water fast thing. So I'm gonna do that now. I'm doing that. No, I don't have no um, fancy <laughs> scale. Uh, I used to, and I left it behind at the old house. Uh, but an old fashion scale is better than no scale. Yeah? Whew. All right. So, we, we're about to get on. Let's see how this goes. Alright, so here we go. Alright. Ah! 
I'm gonna have to get it on my phone. That's a dead lie. <laughs> that is a dead lie. A dead lie. Ain't no way I'm on the 200. Nope. Nope. Lies from the pit to hell. I'm gonna have to get a new scale. That is inaccurate. Absolutely. Absolutely inaccurate. Good morning. I am, well, no, it's afternoon. It's afternoon. Um, I need to hurry up to my face. Because I need to get out of here. <clears throat> uh, I need to be out of here by 12. 30? Yeah. Because I need to be at work for 2 o'clock. Usual, I need to buy a new one. As you can see, I actually use this. Hmm. So supposed to be at work from two to possibly five. We'll see. I want to hurry up because I want to make some tea before I go. I need to charge this. It's about to die. I need to schedule my laser hair removal. Lastly, my good and faithful. And I like this moisturizer because it has 50% SPF. Because honestly, if I had to put on sunscreen and a deco to do this, I don't know if it was gonna happen. But I'm thinking for this year to start incorporating still um, sunscreen, sunblock, whatever, on top of this as an addition. Pencil in my eyebrows. You need to get going, Anna. Just gonna do something light, not too much. Just like fill in the patchy areas. Mm. 
I need to pluck my eyebrows. I need to pluck my eyebrows. I feel like I repeat myself a lot. But that might be my thing. Just might be. <laughs> All right. We are ready to hit the road. The absolute way I lie. Y'all wasn't going to tell me that my hair wasn't done. I feel some type of way. I feel some type of way. Just a little bit. That's my spray water. Bottle. I really would. I ain't gonna hold it against y'all now, but y'all could have told me. I need to wash my hair. It is so dirty. I was so concerned about cleaning my house for the new year. What about washing your hair, Anna? That would have been nice coming into the new year with a clean head. I swear they be tangles and stuff behind here. But... to shave my mustache. Oh, I really need to go get my laser. And I'm not tying it down. Whatever it come out to be, it come out to be. Wash my hands. Now let's go for real, for real. Good evening. So went to work. Came back home. Still on this board of diet. Something in something in me is telling me to go to seven days. We'll see though. I'll see how I feel tomorrow. I'll drink my water. Because even our girls are intermittent fast, so I'll see how I'm feeling. But today was not a great day. The old man got in trouble at school, so that really like brought my day down. 
and it really did mess with me mentally so um yeah uh should be about 12 now yep 12 or 3 i am about to hit my bed um i will talk to y'all in the morning <sighs> and hopefully today is well, today hopefully tomorrow's a better day than today was hey y'all hey it is friday night <laughs> the middle of the night i feel like that's the only time i'll be operating anyway i have not talked to y'all i didn't talk to y'all yesterday at all um uh, i don't know why because it was a mentally exhausting day that's why but we're on day five of my water fast and it's going pretty good like my knee pain like I have my knee it's been hurting me for like I'd say like a good month maybe and it's now feeling better so I'm so happy because that was like kept saying like I really need to go to the doctor I really need to go to the doctor and I was just procrastinating procrastinating and like my knee is feeling so much better like to go upstairs was so painful but now i'm feeling good my skin is so clear like i was <laughs> telling them on my tiki tock that my jawline is starting to look more defined like my skin is clearing up like all over my body i have energy like even if I go to sleep late, I wake up and I'm not tired. Like, I don't feel fatigued. Like, it's, it's so good. Like, I think, like, me fasting, I think that this will be something I'll do at least twice a, twice a year. And the only day that I had a hard time was on day two. Like, <laughs> I tried to record with y'all. And my camera died. And then I tried to record on my phone. And the camera was pointed to towards the door. And I was like, I'm not meant to record this tonight. Yeah? Because I didn't check after I recorded it on my phone. And when I checked the next day, here you are, y'all staring at my door. So anyway, day two was hard. Because my mother, like, I feel like, like my senses are more heightened now that I'm like I'm not eating uh so she made some divine smelling chicken or something that Tuesday and I'm like yo she had the whole house smelling like yo like she used every seasoning possible in her cabinet right then, like, I had to make sandwiches for my son, and I'm like, I'm making sandwiches. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. And then this woman had the nerve to make oatmeal raisin cookies. And I'm like, why are you making oatmeal raisin cookies? You know what? I heard? She's like, oh, I just felt like it. Since when? It's like, oh, you know, I want to start baking more. Why? Why when I'm not eating, I cannot partake in the goodness? Why does you do this to me? It's like, well, we can't go without because you're not eating. You can. You can. Mm. Then yesterday, she made banana bread. smelling up the house good up good up again and then today she made another batch of oatmeal cookies want to tell you i'm so sick of her <laughs> i'm so sick of her. i said next week when i when i'm finally eating regular food again you better be doing all of this you better be doing all of this my way all of it Mm. 
but I spent the evening like looking at like fasting videos so you know learning more about it and why it's so good for the body and also how to come off of my fast so I from one ooh, sorry from one video I was looking at um, the doctor this this um, Asian doctor uh, he was saying, like, you know, once you're coming off fast, he said MCT, MCT oil. I ain't doing that. So I'm going to do maybe a day of bone broth. I mean, not bone broth. Uh, he said bone broth or vegetable broth. I'm going to do a day of vegetable broth because I couldn't find bone broth. I'm going to day do a day of vegetable broth. Or maybe I could just make my own bone broth. I'm a C. I'm a C. That's a possibility. So he said, like how he was explaining, like you could do it all in one day. Like you start off one hour with the bone broth and you, you know, give your belly a little bit of time and then do, he was like the broth, then fermented goods. So he could do like sauerkraut or um, like kimchi or something like that. I don't know where I would get. Well, sauerkraut I could probably find, but mm, to just eat sauerkraut like that, mm, I don't know about that one. Then, so I'm thinking about skipping the fermented um, food step and maybe go from the broth straight to cooked vegetables. And then from cooked vegetables, it's um, animal proteins. So... Yeah, I think each day I'll do one of each group and just, like slowly get back into it. Um, but I'm loving the effects that the fast is having on me. And yeah. Yeah. But I'm about to hit my bed. I change my clothes, wash my face, brush my teeth them, and go into my bed. I promise I'm gonna talk to y'all tomorrow. <laughs> I promise. I promise. I'm gonna talk to y'all tomorrow. Night night. Good morning and happy Saturday, my beautiful loves. I am home alone. I am extremely happy. Cause I get to do a foolishness in my house with nobody looking at me like I'm crazy. You know? So yes, it is Saturday. There isn't really anything to do around the house. Till Charlotte. There isn't anything to do around the house. So I am probably going to try and get uh, all my editing done today so that I can post it for tomorrow morning and then work on this vlog that I'm talking to you all right now. I'm about to have my first anything of the day, which is my, excuse me, mm, my hot water with lemon. So let's do that. All right, let's do that. Promise, Bobby, call you back, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're looking like me, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. You see me be like. I'm not a naughty writer Let me please you right tonight Don't make plans tonight, yeah, no But, get it, oh, no Come here to me, to me Come here to me, let's go Come here, come to me, no Fatu about the jambele, oh, oh, no Fatu about the jambele, oh, jambele, oh I pray to the Lord I write to the Lord Gonna greet the Lord Girl, but I, I, when I said, girl, my neck is close to being the same color as the rest of my body. I ain't never before in life. Mm hmm. Is it crazy? <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Uh, but I like that. When I tell you, I like the effects of it, huh? What makes you want to do it? Ah. Uh, did I see something on, I can't remember. Did I see something on YouTube? I don't know, like, I just felt like, 
a reset of my body for the most part. Mm -hmm. And then I had seen like one of those, you know, what's his freaking name? Uh, he's one of those like dudes. Yes, yeah, Stefan, Stefan Speaks or whatever. Mm. It's a dread guy. So anyway, he had, I had watched something one time where he was on like a podcast or something. He was like, oh, he did one for 14 days. I mean, I do all of that. But um, I started like looking up um, like the benefits of fasting and the benefits of it is like crazy. Like for the last like month, my knee has been bothering me. Like, I had inflammation in the knee, all of that. Like, within these last, my knee stopped hurting. Like, they were just talking about, like, it helps with um, people who have, like, diabetes because the longer you fast, the lower your glucose, glucose levels drop mm -hmm. and the lower your insulin gets. And so it helps with, with like, diabetes. And then, the, again, the longer you fast, the more you go into ketosis and the higher the, your levels, so your, the higher your levels of that, the higher your levels of your growth hormones. So it's like, almost like you produce more um, like stem cells. And then they, they keep talking about something about autophagy. I gotta look up what exactly that is. But they're like, all of those things help with like, just basically like it, the doctor was saying like literally he's like even something as small as a three-day fast it resets your body and like just clears your mind so I'm like okay okay and so what do you so so when you do it is it you can't do cold water it has to be room temperature so for me I can't do it so they didn't say any specifics when it comes to the water mm -hmm. so like he said you can do water, you can do salts of water, you can do tea, like for people who are like real caffeine people, you could do black coffee. Um, I do tea, um, but I try not to do it too much. Like I'll do tea once a day. If so I do, no sugar. no sugar, no sugar, just a straight tea. Um, and then within the last few days, I started incorporating coconut water as well, just as a alternative. Um, but they hadn't said anything about coconut water, but I figure coconut water should be fine. Mm -hmm. But like, so if I don't start off with hot water and lemon, I'll do coconut water with lemon. Okay. And then I'll drink like a bottle or two of water. Then like about midday, I'll do tea. Then drink some, and then probably usually drink a bottle of water after that. Then evening time, I'll do coconut water. And then a bottle of water after that, but. And you constantly pee. Con Usually more so in the evening than in the day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is Saturday night, um, way past my bedtime. Y'all know how I operate. But y'all, y'all gotta pray for me. Right now, my camera. Is in some weird like recovering data mode and it's been this way for a while so I don't know what's going on with my camera <sighs> but I'm trying <laughs> not to let it like get to me or nothing cuz yeah that's the last thing I need my camera like breaking down on me but yeah Thanks again for tuning in for another week. I love you guys. Mwah, 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 mwah. And I'll see y'all next week. No, I, baby, you need more to me.